What up people from the Interverse? My name is Danny. Welcome. Today I'm going to show you something that is quite easy to do. This is for the people that have Universal Audio, Apollo Twin or whatever version of Apollo you have. Now, we all know that we've been having issues with Apollo this, um, say last, last year. Um, I've been having this problem for a while, but this is what I do um, to get rid of the problem. This um, method that I'm going to show you guys might work for everyone, but also might not work for some people. So as I go with my universal audio, if I find any, any different way, I will show you guys how to make sure that um, your universal audio works. So let me just show you um, what version of Apple, what version of um, Mac OS I'm using right now. Um, so I'm using basically right now, um, as you can see, my, a version 11.5.1, which is literally just, I just updated this a few hours ago. You open terminal. Okay. Terminal. All right. You put this command there. Okay. Once you put this command there, if you go back to your system, If you go back to your system, every time I want to open system, this happens anyway. You go back to your system, you go to your security. You should see where it said anywhere. Okay. Normally you will not see anywhere. If you look into your system, you will not find anywhere, but now you would have to find the word anywhere there. Once that is done, once that is done, you restart your computer. You come back. When you come back into your system, you go to your library from your library. So you go to your main drive, library, extension, you delete this one here. This is at the moment the only uh, universal thing I'm seeing on my system. You, you delete this one here. If you see one or two, you delete them. It doesn't matter how many, anything you see with the name UAD on it, you delete it if it's in your extension. Okay. You delete it. And then from there, you go to, you go to this one here. You go to your, to your main drive, library, application support. From your application support, you go all the way down to universal audio. You delete everything in here. Put it all in your bin. Okay. Once that is done, you get that from there. You go to your application. Okay. Universal audio. You go in here, you see where it says uninstall, you uninstall everything. Once that is finished, you go to your bin, okay? Because the files that you just uh, deleted from these two files there, they're gonna be in your bin. You basically delete them from your bin. You get rid of them from your bin. What you do next is you restart your system, okay? Restart the system, give it about five minutes, Okay, let it cool down, let everything cool down, give it five minutes and, and start it up again. When you're starting up your system, make sure your Apollo Twin is on first before you start up your system, just to let you know. So you do that, then you come all the way back. When you come back, you go to the Universal Audio website, or if you already downloaded, you go to wherever you've downloaded and saved this. You, I would say to, for easy access, just put it on your desk, desktop, that's what, that'll be the easiest way to find it or whatever, whatever works for you. You go into it, you install the new, the new drive. Okay. You install either if you have 11, you install 11. If you got 10, you install 10. It doesn't matter which one you have. You install it. Once you install it, you give it some time to do its thing, whatever. Once all of that is finished. Okay. There's one thing I think I forgot to say. Once all of that is finished. I will show you something. Let's go to system again. Okay, once all of that finished, you go to your system security. This is once you finish installing everything, yeah? And you restart your computer. When you come back in, you go to your system and preferences, okay? You see where it says anywhere. This is very good, actually, this happened. I will show you something. So you press this. All 
Okay. And I'll go here detail. Now, because it's because the anywhere thing is showing now, you will see what I'm talking about. All of this here, all of these things that you see here, they are asking you to give them permission to basically operate on your system. Universal Twin is going to ask you the same damn shit. Universal Audio Update, is, it will ask you the same shit. You would have to press on it, okay? To give it permission so basically so it can do its thing. So you said, okay, right? Mine is already pressed in because it's already done, but you give it okay or whatever other stuff you want to give to permission to access your system, you give them okay, you press okay, detail, and then afterwards it will ask you to restart your system again. Okay? So this is what you have to do, all right? Follow the steps, it's going to work. It's a headache, but it's one that we can all get around. Um, so give this a try, okay? Every time I'm finding new ways to do this easier. I've posted a couple of videos about this before and I'll continue posting videos where I'm finding more solutions. I think this works best for everyone. If it does work for you and you think it's helped you a lot, don't forget to share, to give to people who are going through the same issue. Um, let's just help each other. I will post, I will put this command. Um, where it is? Where is it actually? I will put this command here onto the uh, description of the video down to show you that this work. I will put the command there so you can use it on your terminal and you can actually go through it yourself. If this is the first time you're having this issue, I hope this works for you. If it doesn't work, I'm sorry. This is the only thing I can do. And I'm very sorry for the fucking back one, background noise because I, my window is open and I live, I live in a busy street. So I, I'm looking forward to move away so I can actually start working on some music because I can't do anything because there's cars going up and down 24 seven. And if there's one thing that we musicians hate, we hate unnecessary fucking noise in our sound. Um, yeah, so give it a try, okay? I hope this works, guys. Take it easy.